All right, what's going on YouTube? Card Collector 2 coming at you here with a brand new video. And today we are back with all of our pickups from the Chicago Sports Spectacular show that we just attended this past weekend. So first of all, if you have not seen the two vlogs from the show, feel free to check those out below. But we're just gonna get right into the pickups as we've got six piles of random assorted, wide variety of stuff that we picked up at the show. So want to just get right into it try to show you guys this stuff while uh, if, you know respecting your time that you might not want to spend two hours watching this so going at a quicker pace but also spending time at least showing you what it is so we try to show that every single pickup we got like anytime we something that was filmed that we acquired something we tried to put the cards in the videos I know that was one of the feedbacks that we've gotten in the past was hey we want to be able to see the cards some people have said that the cards are harder to see, so we're working on that. Um, that's why I always make the pickups videos so I can try to explain it a little better on like why we might have bought something, the thought process there. Um, so again, always open to different feedback. Certainly appreciate any, especially positive constructive criticism, not just uh, maybe, hey, your videos suck. Um, that doesn't really do us as much good, so if you have something you wanna see, please know we do pay attention to those and uh, we're always trying to improve. So. That being said, I uh, pointed this out in the video. These were 50% off and ended up getting five bucks off additionally. So it came to 45 bucks, got both of these for 40. Thought that was just kind of a no brainer. Uh, Cam Reddish select silver rookie auto. Um, wait, not rookie auto. I actually did not notice that originally. I thought this was a rookie. That's a dupe on my part. Um, still probably not that bad, but it probably helps I got the five bucks off. I thought this was a rookie. It's actually not. I literally just noticed that. Um, Cam Reddish, and then Jalen Waddle. Team color match, uh, 75 of 199. Got a lot of stuff. So I picked this lot up off a guy. Really nice. Um, so F1, first year F1. This is an F2 driver, I believe. Um, but it's a 101 super. I just You don't see these too often. And again, I'm trying to get more into the F1 space. So I'm going to grab this and just hang on to it for a little while. Uh, Tiger, dual. Got to love Tiger, especially the Sunday red. Uh, Elena Del Don Auto, one of the WNBA goats. This is kind of cool. It's funny. After I went to this table, right, I, I went home. Like I talked about this before. What I'll do is I'll go back to the hotel room and I'll think like, which cards are on my mind from the day earlier. Like I, I'll just remember things that I saw at the show and I'll try to comp them. And this guy had a bunch of stuff. Like I told Brian, like we should have went back because he had some really cool stuff and the prices were really really competitive. Um, he had like an Alex Morgan one of these. There was some stuff I definitely, definitely, definitely should have bought, um, but just forgot to go back the second day. Ohio State was playing, so my, my brain uh, wasn't super focused on the show per se. We did spend a ton the second day, but probably should have went back and bought more because he had some really cool stuff. Got a couple messy. That's first year Prism, World Cup, and then a couple cheap Ronaldos. Got those. Uh, then bought this lot um, off a younger collector. So these were in a five dollar. It was five dollars a piece, or five four for twenty. Five for twenty, yeah, five for twenty. Um, so basically four bucks a piece if you buy them in bulk. So this was the one Brian didn't capture on the camera, but I was like, I think this might be a good buy, and I bought it and I looked it up later and it's stuff. It's off centered, but I think these do like north of twenty bucks. Brendan McKay jersey auto at a ninety nine. I know he was popular at one point. Just took a chance on it for four bucks. Uh, Thurman Thomas jersey, Jim Kelly jersey, Jalen Smith patch out of 50, and then Quiddy Pay Auto for uh, the Colts. Uh, so I bought those with these for $2.90. So it was that stack of the cheap $4 stuff and all of these for $2.90. Nice Archie Griffin Auto, he, Buckeyes, greatest of all, you know, one of the greatest running backs in college football history, two time Heisman. Auto to 25, doesn't have a ton of pro stuff, and the Bengals are local. Kind of a cool local card. Shane Buchel, 101. Um, Leaf Metal. Does, I just, I'll take a chance on a quarterback 101 from Leaf Metal for the price. This seemed cheap. Oscar Robertson auto from Elite. He had a 35. That doesn't seem too bad for the big O. Didn't even look, but didn't seem like it was a bad deal. And then Morant uh, out of 20. Corners are in amazing condition, but I think the last one of these did like around three. Um, so... Kind of a kind of felt good about that lot. I uh, got this lot um, inside the numbers AP game used jersey Jalen Waddle one of thirty five and a Devonta Smith patch paid like eighty five or ninety bucks for these. Uh, out of twenty five Devonta Smith 
Waddle again is one of 35, and then the AP is out of 50, but it's game used. So there's what those look like. All right, moving along. This is the first lot right here we bought on the start of the second day. Uh, original PMG. So Ricky Dudley is a Buckeye. You can see near the Fleer Metal logo, it's got some surface peeling, so it's not in amazing shape, but you don't see PMGs a lot, and uh, it's a Buckeye, so figured we'd grab that. Uh, Brandon Ingram, nine. That was too high, but he cut us a deal on it. Lamar, uh, 25. I think we paid like 500 bucks for everything. Steph Curry, 10. Uh, Ernie Banks, 68 tops. Kaepernick, 9. Uh, Mbappe, Min Gem from Prism. His stuff's cheap. Uh, and then a Bobby Hull, uh, 71 tops. SGC, 1. So, got the whole stack for 500 bucks. I'll probably keep the Dudley and sell the rest of those on like an upcoming live sale or uh, our website or something like that. Then picked this lot up, some cheap uh, F1. I want to say it was like 200 bucks for the entire lot. So these were in the dollar bin, these Charles Leclerc's. Charles is one of the guys that I, uh, I've i been probably most interested in from watching the Drive to Survive documentary. So I picked those up, just gonna stash those. I'll probably stash all of these to be honest. Uh, then he had a Lewis 70th gold, uh, a couple of Leclerc purples at a 399, and then a bunch of the Russell base rookies. So since he's driving for Mercedes next year, next to Lewis, figured I'd grab a couple of these. I'll probably look at grading them, especially if PSA brings back a cheaper option in the near future. I think those might be a play, but got to do some more research on it. I uh, got both of these for 10 bucks. He had $3 on the orange sticker and $10 on that. Uh, I was like, hey, we take 10 for both. He said, yeah. Uh, Kirby Pocket sells okay. It's a gold refractor. Gold's probably the most popular color in all of cards. Right, people want gold refractors more than anything. Look at gold prisms. So I figured that could be, you know, eight bucks, and then Jamal Murray nine, just a cheap slab of a NBA superstar. Um, then I got so this whole lot we put in the video. The whole box was marked fifty percent off, and I think he gave it all to me for a hundred. Um, so Nanika at a twenty-five pulsar. I don't think that's jersey number. Uh, Burrow and Ken Anderson dual Burrow stuff is really popular in Columbus, especially this like cheap jersey patches and that kind of stuff. So when I can get $10, $15 jerseys, that kind of stuff just it moves so well in shop. Uh, Rondell Moore auto at a 125. I think the he's going to be good, and I think the Cardinals are good. Uh, Brittany Griner, uh, 6 of 25, Pulsar. I thought this, without looking, without looking, this does not seem bad. I bought a Trey Lance non-numbered, like this for like a dollar or something a couple weeks ago in Ship Shawana and looked it up and they did like 15 or $20. So I have a hard time believing that a numbered out of 100 Trevor Lawrence rookie is not more than $15. I could be way, way, way off on this. Um, I will, I'll double check, but that to me for 15 bucks, right? And 50% off, so 750. I was like, man, I, you got to take a chance on it at that. Same thing with this. Uh, I was like, hey, these don't seem like bad buys at 15 bucks, but they're half off, even better. Uh, Hakeem Jersey out of 75 uh, from Chronology. Dwight Clark Auto for 10 bucks, rest in peace. Um, you know, one of the more infamous catches of all time with the catch. Um, just, I mean, can't go wrong with a, oh, I think it's 06 Legends. Yeah, 06 UD Football Legends. Uh, Kadoni, uh, Kadarius Tony's not playing too bad this year. Giants aren't very good, but. Triple with Danny Dines at a twenty at a seventy-five for five bucks. Uh, Chuba Hubbard patch auto at a seventy-five or Chuba Hubbard. I'm sorry, I don't think it's Chuba. I'm pretty sure it's Chuba. Chuba Hubbard uh, at a seventy-five patch auto. Uh, Chuba Hubbard auto at a one twenty-five. Again, half off. Burrow Prism for fifteen bucks seems like a no-brainer. And then a Burrow Select Red rookie jersey for twelve fifty. So it comes up to fifty-five, seventy-five. There's one oh five. 115, 135, 145, 175, 200, 235, 241, so 120, 50, and he gave me an additional 20 bucks off. So got these for less than 50%. Really, really nice guy too. So that was a cool lot. Uh, picked these up. This is, I don't remember what the price. It was in the first first vlog. It was one of the first deals we bought. Uh, saw this in a eight, at eight bucks. I didn't think this was too bad. I know Harden doesn't get the love that Curry does, but the Curry version of this sells for a lot 
So it was like for eight bucks, especially if you're getting in bulk. You're basically getting it for free with the discount. Because he gave me these, uh, gave me these three at 50, and I think I added this at like, so it might have been like 130 for all of it. Uh, but Andre Reed on card and Bill Romanowski on card immaculate autos and a Harden jersey for 50 bucks. That's a no-brainer and a nice Brady numbered heroes. This hero sells set sells well and Tom Brady, right? The goat. I mean, it's won seven rings and just I mean, doesn't look a day over 30. All right. So most of these should be in order. I think we did a pretty good job since we showed them in the video. We did a pretty good job of keeping them in order. Um, so if you watch the videos, if you watch the blogs, while Ohio State was playing, I sat down at these value boxes and went through them. They were good value boxes. I knew the guy selling them. Um, his name is Curtis. And I was like, I don't want to leave if Ohio State's playing. So we just sit here and just go through the value boxes while we watch the game. That's what we did. So I'll show you this last because this was the second half of the deal. I'll set those like right there. So this was the first half. So he told me in it when I came up, it was 80% off. Um, and then he gave me a little slight better break at the end. So probably 77% of the sticker price is roughly what we would have paid. So basically I'm looking for good deals that I think are already priced competitively and then hoping you're going to save money there. Hawkinson, uh, Boone Jenner, and Eric Lindros. Jenner's a jacket, one of one. Don't know much about the product, but that was still cool. C.D. Lamb Mosaic, James Conner. I had him in fantasy, so I, the only reason I know this, but I, b before, like, last week, I think he led the NFL in touchdowns. Um, so I was like, for 10 bucks, 11 bucks, like, I'll take a chance on it. Uh, Nitschke, Legends Auto, those are kind of, that's a pretty, uh, pretty popular set. Don't know much, I, t I talk about this all the time. Baseball is not my forte, it's not the sport I know the best. But when we were ripping some Bowman Chrome the other day, people were talking a lot about this guy. So I was like, for 15 bucks, I'll take a chance on it and see what happens. Uh, so Ed Howard Auto, I know he's a Cubs prospect. Uh, Hopkins 101, didn't seem too bad for a top two or three receiver. So this is a rookie auto die cut from 2017 Elite of James Conner. Again, getting some, uh, some TDs down there in Arizona. Uh, Jarvis sells well in Columbus, being a Br uh, Browns player. Uh, Warren Sapp. Bucks legend at a 25. Grayson Allen, shout out to Tyler on Card Talk. Uh, my guy talks about um, Grayson Allen. The next card I'm actually not going to show. It's nothing crazy, uh, but it is a gift. So um, just for the fear that somebody might watch this, I, it is something I'm going to send somebody. So I'm not going to show it because um, it doesn't really matter what I paid for it, but it's one thing I want to gift somebody and I want it to be more of a surprise. Uh, Marquise Hollywood Brown Auto at a 199 for $7 for... Lamar Jackson's number one target at the moment. We'll take a shot. Um, I realize Andrews is there. Bateman looks good, but Brown's, I think, the guy. Calvin Ridley for 7 bucks. Again, I'm willing to take a chance. You'll notice throughout I bought a bunch of these Steph Currys. I've I'm, I'm been picking a lot of Steph stuff up. Uh, this is like second year, third year mosaic. Um, just some Steph color. Cheap. Uh, for $7, it didn't seem bad to get some Galactics. I think he's in Chicago now, but early Galactics for 7 bucks. Uh, this is second year Watson Red. I don't believe Watson's going to play this year. I think he's going to miss the entire year. I think he will play next year. So second year Prism Red. I think he's going to end up getting traded. We'll see. But for $38, $40, bucks, i will sit on it and just see what happens. Earl Thomas, Seahawks Legion of Boom stuff, typically always does well. Not sure if he still sells as well as he did at one point. But again, at some point, you just got to take a chance on something and uh, see what happens. It's how you learn. So for 15 bucks, we'll test it and see if it works or not. Hawkinson RPA, the, one of the few bright spots on the Lions. Uh, him and Swift, Big Ben rookie jersey. Uh, Waddle RPA uh, out of 199 from Legacy. Uh, Dame, Dame sells pretty well, and this is out of 25. So 1819 Mosaic out of 25, that didn't seem like a bad buy for, what, 24 bucks? So uh, Curry Blue. Not numbered, but still trying to buy some of those. Michael Red is a Buckeye, and I've actually met him before. Really, really nice guy. Uh, patch from 1617 Noir, and it is game used. Um, so I'll keep that. Now there's Steph. Towns Prism. This seemed cheap. Prism Silver Auto at Towns. I know he doesn't get the hobby level. I'm fully aware. Um, but, you know, 20% off this is 7 bucks, 28 so slightly less than that. You know, 26 bucks for a Towns Auto. It just doesn't, doesn't seem that bad. Uh, Reds, first Bowman Auto from Sapphire. That'll, that'll go local. Uh, Allie Krieger, Goodwin, Champions Auto. 
Isaiah Stewart. Uh, I bought this, I think, before him. Yeah, this would have been before. This would have been before because this would have been Saturday, and he got into it with LeBron Sunday. But I was actually looking up Isaiah Stewart stuff at the show for some reason. And he actually he actually sells well. Um, so decided to take a chance on that. And then, ironically, he got into the scuffle with LeBron. Out of 49, Anthony Edwards. Anthony Edwards stuff is hot. Um, it's not crazy, crazy hot, but this didn't seem bad, and I don't think it's going to be bad. There's no comps on this, but I think like a Crusade did like $50, and this is the base, and I would have got 23% off. So, you know, nothing crazy, but to get in this closer to like 60 bucks didn't feel too bad. Uh, Manning, that's, you know, football, football icons right there. I mean, one of the more prestigious families in football, Archie Manning Auto. Uh, Toppin, not looking terrible this year, and he's a Dayton kid. That'll probably go in shop. Uh, Draymond Vortex, the Warriors are good. Draymond is going to go down as, you know, he's going to be remembered with Steph, Clay, and uh, him for winning some rings, so I'll take a chance on that cheap. Calvin Dwayne Jarrett patch. Look at this patch. You guys know, uh, if you've watched any of our content, I like picking up Megatron stuff. Figure that'll uh, that'll sell pretty well. Train Lance Auto for under 50 bucks Seems like not a terrible buy. Uh, Najee Harris for about 30 bucks, 28 at 40 auto. Again, same thing. Uh, Linbound actually does not sell like the worst of all time. So to get an auto with the inscription, the Joker, I figured this might be a sneaky play. Sometimes the inscriptions can add something here. We'll see, but for $7, right? You couldn't get a water and a hot dog at the show for $7. So I'm willing to take a chance on this to see if I can make, you know, a few bucks on it, right? Just we'll see what happens. Oh, I said this was cheap. Any old school Griffey Refractor PSA graded, we'll take a chance on. And then two Mahomes rookie PSA 9s. Um, again, 13 bucks off of those at 20%. It's going to put you right around the $50 mark per. per. And the Chiefs have uh, have definitely improved the last couple last couple weeks. All right, so I bought that. And then he's like, hey, we have this higher end box. Did you go through that? And I hadn't. So I'll try to speed this up here because I know we've got piles left and we're 17 minutes in or so. Uh, you got an Aaron Judge auto at a 15. Uh, Jim Brown, Newsome, Warfield, and Groza. Really cool patch uh, at an 85. Levine Galactic. Um, looked at Levine stuff up, and while I'm not the biggest fan of like him as a collector, I don't enjoy collecting him. He actually, some of his stuff does decent, so I figured that's not terrible. Uh, AD auto at a 99. Miochik auto. These are the ones I looked up that I thought the values were a little high on. Um, Miochik. Herbert auto at a 35. Votto, Patch Auto, uh, 4 of 5, and a Larry Bird Leaf Metal Auto. So I ended up getting this whole pile for like 700 I think that was a $700 pile. Um, then you've got... All right, so this pile, worked to deal with this gentleman, really nice. Uh, Brian didn't capture it. The, the camera was off, but found this in a $2 bin. Uh, shout out to Phil Hughes. I know he's a card collector. Um, so I think this is cool. Like, I'll pick up him. I'll pick up Kafka guys like that because they collect cards. I just think it's cool to collect former athletes who uh, who also collect. So I picked that up for two bucks. Don't know Phil personally, but I just think it's neat. Uh, so I got that and all of these for two, 280. So uh, Eli's score, these were cheap. These were like a, these three were in a $3 bin or like a $4 bin, three for 10. Again, just local Eddie George, Buckeye, Cheap slabs, like this kind of stuff's moved, so it's not going to sell for fifteen dollars, but it's going to sell for you know six to eight bucks. Uh, Adam Dunn Bowman Chrome PSA nine, and this is cool. I don't love the grading company, but an old school Yankees numbered jersey for three bucks essentially because it was three for ten. Sure. Uh, LeBron first year Prism nine or second year, second year Prism nine. Sean Kemp rookie ten. I don't know what this card sells for, but it did not seem like a bad buy for that price, especially because he gave me a bulk discount. Uh, Ichiro, rookie, PSA 9. Uh, Russell Wilson, tops 9. Randy Moss, Bowman, Chrome, 9. Randy Moss, tops 9. Uh, Tracy McGrady, rookie, Bowman's best, 9. Drew Brees, rookies and stars, rookie, uh, PSA 8. And then a Mike Trout, purple refractor, PSA 9. So got all those with the Phil Hughes for 280. And then went over to his other deals, and I don't remember... I want to say it was 450. I think 450 is the number that comes to mind. Don't quote me on that. I think this is 450, but just go through these. Uh, Jim Kelly, Thurman Thomas, dual eye black auto, 
Love the eye black. Thought it was a cool card. Uh, Manning Favre dual jersey out of 100. Walter Payton game used jersey out of 50. Uh, Jim Brown old school out of 25. Definitely a PC card. Nice Eddie George autographics auto. And then a Thurman Thomas patch from 2019 Chronicles 3 color. Don't know why it was the buy the Buffalo Bills show for me, but somehow it worked out to be that. Uh, B-Doc. Nice Brian Dawkins Hall of Fame signature. Uh, Steve Largent, Don Maynard, dual exquisite auto at a 35. Um, 16 of 35. And then a Marcus Allen NT triple patch auto, which is 6 of 25. This is 2006. This is first year National Treasures, I believe. I'm almost positive. 06 with Reggie Bush, Liner, Vince Young is first year uh, NT. So got that. And then did get this big deal done. You guys saw it in the video. I uh, picked this up this lot up off my guy Shannon. I uh, had a Barry Bonds old school heritage on card auto. Nice Ichiro old school jersey out of 200 with a nice bold blue auto. This is probably my favorite pickup. This will be kept in the PC for sure. Uh, Brady, Kurt Warner, co-signers dual auto from 2002. Probably one of Brady's first 10 to 25 autos. I mean, he's got a couple rookie autos, but it's got to be one of Brady's earlier autos. Uh, Lamello patch from Flawless Collegiate out of 20. This kid's a stud. Uh, Dak, one of one game used patch. Pretty sick. A Steph Curry auto, definitely going to go in the PC. I mentioned it at the start of the videos. We're trying to find some cool F1. Brady, McDavid, uh, Curry ended up getting a couple of those goals. So we'll definitely be stashing that. Nice Devontae Adams RPA out of 99. Uh, pick this lot up. Early on, this was really cool. The guy was really easy to work with. Got a nice Mike Trout bat. Uh, Newt Rockney, this is super cool. Notre Dame legend. Uh, coach, like sweater or jacket. Uh, Peyton Manning at a 250. Uh, nice football with the N from NFL. Uh, Singletary, auto for the Bears. A Whit Merrifield, one of one uh, letter from Tops. And then a Pedroia and Nomar, dual auto, two of ten. Looks like Nomar inscribed to five, so I don't assume he's two. I don't think Pedroia's two, but that would be cool if it was jersey numbered. But Red Sox stuff obviously moves super well. So I picked those up. And then, last but not least, again, guys, if you guys enjoy these videos, let me know. Leave some comments. Leave a thumbs up. Uh, feel free to subscribe. Those kind of things help us. Let us know which videos you guys want to see more of, uh, which things we need to improve on, etc. So... If you would not mind, leave a thumbs up. We would greatly, greatly appreciate it. All right, last but not least, we've got, real quick, before I go into that, I did pick this up. I've wanted one of these for a while. Seller gave me a really good deal on it. $5.75 for the full entire F1 complete set. I'm going to end up putting this in a binder in pages like, an, like I would have done old school uh, and just sit on that for a while. I'm getting into F1. I enjoy watching the documentary. I watch it with my wife. So that'll likely be something I just uh, put in the binders and see what happens 15 years from now. All right, so pick this deal up off of a super, super nice gentleman. Uh, it's a Jim Brown patch, 33 out of 40, one off his jersey number. Immortals, Jim Brown out of 100 jersey. A very, very nice Justin Herbert jersey numbered patch auto, four color, 10 of 60. I think that's a sneaky play. I like that card. Uh, and then another one of these for my PC. There's a couple of these in the show. This is the really one of the only guys that was willing to sell it to me at uh, four grand or at two grand. Um, that's what I was willing to pay for for, and I was like, because that's what I paid right around there for my other couple that I had, that I uh, had purchased at the national. So uh, when I saw it, sure, gonna throw that in the PC. So the Jim Brown for sure, those will uh, will definitely be PC. Picked this up off a younger collector you guys saw in the video. Um, he's like, I bought it for eight. I'd sell it for ten. Respect the hustle, so I definitely had to buy that. Uh, bought these off my guy Kevin. Uh, Denny Clear Ticket Auto ended up paying 100 for that. Not sure if that's a good deal or not, but we'll see. Uh, and then the rest of this was like 400. Nice Johnny Bench uh, Tiger. Uh, Lucic. Lukic? Lukic? I don't know. Out of 100, PMG. Uh, Greeny. Out of 10, Getter Auto. That's kind of cool. I'll, I'll keep that in the PC. Some cool Pro Bowl patches of Peterson and Bobby Wagner. This is out of 57. This is out of 44. Odd numbering, but nonetheless. Uh, Trevor Lawrence, Ricky Otto. Got that for about 100. 
Uh, George Foster, one of one, old school Reds patch auto. Thought that was cool. It's game one. A Paul Molitor, uh, old school one of one. It's like 03. 04, um, playoff prime. Prime cuts, I think. So, uh, and then a Damian Harris crossover NTRPA 22 of 99. So, pick that lot up. And then, as we wrap this video up, shout out to those of you that made it this far. Uh, grab this for 50 bucks. Brady, cheap PSA 9 slab. Easy to move type stuff. Pick this up off my guys over at Indie Card Exchange. Uh, Zach Wilson out of 49 patch auto. Zach Wilson, 5 of 25. This is cool. This is a green parallel, kind of that team color match type thing. I understand he's in a white jersey there, but nonetheless, two Zach Wilson autos. Uh, I'm going to likely stash this. Anthony Edwards, Prism Red out of 299 PSA 9. And then a Devonta Smith, True Gem Plus XRC, 395s and a 10 sub on that. And then last but not least, probably one of my, one of the better deals at the show, I would say. Um... Saw this at 125, and I was like, okay, let me go through the value boxes, see what I can piece around it. And if you guys watched the video, uh, this is the stack I originally presented, and it was uh, nothing was priced, and it was like he's like, hey, I'll do 10 bucks for everything. Uh, Brady Chrome, another Brady Chrome. Uh, I think this is sneaky. I have not looked this up, but Akeem Hicks does not have many cards. That's at a 99. I think this is his first card. Um, if I had to guess when I bought it, I would have said about 20 bucks is what it's worth. We'll see, but I think that's sneaky. A Dalton Schultz out of 25. I have him in fantasy, so I know that this is where fantasy helps, right? You learn a lot about who's good. Um, I have him in fantasy, and I think he's like a top 10 fantasy tight end. So uh, with Blake Jarwin out for the year, I thought that might be decent. It's worth a couple bucks. Some white sparkles. Alberto, shout out to the guys that watch the break. CC2 exclusive. We pulled him all the time. Sterling Shepard and Logan Wilson. Got to be, you know, $7.99, 5 to 10 bucks basically on some white sparkles. And then Jamar Chase. These, I think, do about 6 to 8 bucks. Um, not sure that'll last forever, but for a buck, I'll take a chance. So this whole lot was $10. Percentage-wise, it's probably going to be one of the better lots. Um, so he said he would do 105 on that, um, basically 95 and a hundred or 10 And I was like, well, hey, we throw this Jonathan Taylor in for... Uh, for 105 total and he said yeah and of course the day after he uh has that major major game five touchdowns last week against the bills so yeah uh really a great show we really picked up some cool stuff this show some stuff i'm excited to uh to uh to get listed gonna go through some of it and like i said get it sorted maybe some upcoming sales on whatnot some upcoming sales on loop make sure you guys follow us on there if you have not because that's where we will be selling a lot of stuff Still listing stuff on eBay, adding stuff to the website. Those links are down below. But for now, guys, that's all I got. Peace.